So here's my item level, guys. And here are my talents. If you guys want to copy those, feel free to do so. We are finally going to push this guy to max level here soon. Um, pretty much how it went down was Havoc Demon Hunters were really dog shit at the beginning of the expansion. God damn it, made you God dang God dang made you. Anyway, uh, that was the worst metamorphosis ever. We're just going to one-shot him just out of, like, uh, sadness, I suppose. But anyway... I didn't really play Havoc at the beginning of the expansion, mainly because I really, really thought that uh, it wouldn't get buffed, but here we are and it's finally decent, so I'm actually going to level it now. At least that was a thought process when I was playing this guy towards the beginning of the expansion. It really just weren't doing too great. I was like, there's no point in trying to play this guy if he's just going to be super unviable and stuff, so. Now here we are. Demon Hunter's kind of just one-shotting things again. Uh, it's, it's a beautiful sight, man. It's a beautiful sight. In my opinion, I like it. I think Demon Hunter's kind of got the shaft early on in the expansion, but I don't know. I don't, I don't think they'll be as bad anymore. I mean, they'll still be kind of rough to play in my opinion, but it's not going to be like, oh, this is completely unviable, I'm not having a fun time type of thing, which was 100% my experience when Shadowlands first came out and I tried to PvP on this guy. That's a mix of everything being incredibly strong at the beginning of an expansion. Uh, not looking and pointing in any fingers, but uh, Sub Rogue at the beginning of the expansion was a little troublesome for Demon Hunter. And, yeah, I don't know. It, it's just nice having Demon Hunter be kind of good again. Bamboozled me, dude. Fucking got my ass. Uh, unbound chaos damage, though. So. Come here, warrior. Come here. Oh, I missed it. And they have three nodes. What is this, man? Just give me a berserking and I can... I can just literally one-shot one of these guys. I believe... One, two, A Actually worked. Predicted the berserking, man. So yeah, we will be leveling this guy. Say goodnight, motherfucker. <laughs> 11,000. Now we go on you. Let's stun. He is in range of the boomy, so that was really, really nice. We're not really going for objective captures, it looks like, here. We're just going for the honorable kills, as one should. Good stun, both these guys here. Immolation aura. Interrupt. I beam. Fleshcraft feels bad. We're gonna dash through this healer here. Not not this guy, but this guy. The guy with the orb that we hit for 5,000 for no reason. Another reason I actually do think uh, Havoc Demon Hunter is now viable is because of the changes they did make to Unbound Chaos. Um, they did implement some changes and revert some changes when they were first kind of testing out. In PTR, at least, I guess, the Unbound Chaos damage. Oof, oof, mercy, mercy. Interrupt that. And we're dead. Yep. Of course, we don't have any self heal still, but... So, the changes they reverted slash implemented in PTR, I'm pretty sure it was Unbound Chaos changes, and... What it is now is different than it was in 9.0.2 or 9.0. whatever was released whenever Shadowlands came out, but pretty much the only change here is, uh, pretty sure the damage was 200% lower, and now it's hovering at around 600%. Then, of course, Unbound Chaos mixed with the Hunt is literal one-shots right now in Arena, so that's kind of encouraging me to level, <laughs> to level the Demon Hunter a little bit. Of course, everything's one-shotting right now, but... You know, Demon Hunter has a has a special place. Yeah, I'll let you get that objective, man. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you get that. Always a warrior that grabs it, too. Let's go, team. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Really just want Fury on these guys. Hello. Got him, dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> you can't even heal through that, though. That's like the worst part. 
It's the worst slash best part. You can't heal through that at all. Of course, the downside to Havoc Demon Hunter is our normal damage. I do think our normal damage is kind of just still really bad, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't really have any other comments on it. I think our normal damage is just kind of lackluster. It could be a lot better. It really could. But I don't, I don't think Blizzard's going to change our mediocre kind of normal damage when we have a literal one shot at our disposal on pretty much a 1.5 minute cooldown. But hey, we can hope. We can we can hope Blizzard throws some changes our way. Oh, another Demon Hunter. I see, I see. I also have thought about this in the past. There's a certain legendary that... I think it's whenever you I-beam, you have a chance to summon... Or you do summon. It's not a chance. You do summon like a Vengeance or Havoc Demon Hunter that will just either cast Fell Devastation or cast I-beam. I really want to try it out. I've ran with Demon Hunters in the past where they've ran that build, and it seems really, really, really strong. Um, more or less like 25% of a Demon Hunter's damage one running that legendary is just I-Beam and Fell Devastation damage, so... And of course, to buff that even further, I think if you went I-Beam duration, increased talent. I'm assuming that would increase the channel time of Fell Devastation through the legendary as well, but... I don't know. It could also not be like that, and then we'd just take that talent for nothing. Let me dash. And dash, and dead. God, the fucking fell rush damage, man. It's so nice to have. So damn nice to have. This guy has a shit ton of haste. Oh, he's from Ragnaros, too. I kind of want to stunt on him with an XD, but... I'll, 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 I'll spare him that horrible fate. That horrible, horrible fate. We need another one-shot, boys. We need another one-shot. Jin Sang Chi, come over here, man. Hey. Hey there, warrior. Warrior buddy. Come here, buddy. Dash, dead. <laughs> so dumb. So dumb, but so fun. We're just gonna I-beam. How much damage will it do? We started at like 8,000, so that's at about 8,000. Or, sorry, 3,000 of his health. Not too bad, not too bad. Now we need one more hunt. Bitch. You goddamn bitch. That's okay. Click the flag, Jun Sang Chi. You know you want to. Hey, come here, buddy. Hey, come here, buddy. Oh, you loved it. <laughs> You'll love to see it. Oh, man. Yeah, this is why I'm rolling Havoc. This is, I'm not rolling Havoc as a main, but this is why I am going to start leveling my Havoc. Mainly, God, how, how can you not? How can you not, man? I, I imagine if I get, you know, 200 item level, it won't... It'll be a little bit more tanky, but it won't be incredibly tanky like an arms warrior, but I don't know, man. It, it'll just be fun to play around with. Oh, that's two warriors. That's two decent players right there. Imagine using Sinful Brand, man. Who are you? Not sure if that guy DC to right. It's also nice. I think they buffed Blade Dance secretly and just didn't say anything about it. Because I swear Blade Dance used to hit for absolutely nothing. Now it's actually hitting for something. Oh, uh, would you look at that, Mage? Would you look at that? The Berserking you'd grabbed is uh, a little wasted here. Just a tiny bit. What to do? What to do? I should have used my Unbound Chaos there, but that's okay. I do want to look at my damage just to see, like, in general, what did good. Let me drag this over. Don't reset. There we go. Damage. Total damage. Bell Rush out DPSing the hunt. 10k crits at level 59. Yeah, dude. I cannot wait to level this guy. It will take a little bit of time to actually hit max level, because the Shadowlands leveling process is absolutely atrocious. By the way, farm herbs, farm minerals, and do dungeons if you want to skip the horrible questing experience. But yeah, expect this guy to be 60 sometime soon. Thank you guys very much for watching. Check out the drinking stream April 30th, 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Also a WoW token giveaway as well during that stream. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Until next time, take it easy, have a good one, and I'll see you later.